Oh, 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 I see you. Are you doing beautiful? Oh, you looking cute. You do something different with yourself. You looking good. What? Thanks for being here. Like, it is so nice having such a beautiful human being watching me speak right now. Thank you for being here. Today, hair hacks. I dove deep into hair hacks once. It was quite a experience. I followed a hair hack video and made hair hack dry shampoo. Wasn't the best. Oh, I made pineapple out of hair. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, I completely understand. We basically made a pineapple out of pipe cleaners. I don't really remember what we did, but it was wild. That video opened up my eyes to the hack world on YouTube. One YouTube channel in particular, Five Minute Crafts, has plenty of hair hack videos. So today, why don't we just sit down and just watch all of the crazy sh they make up in order to make a oddly satisfying and interesting video that makes kind of no sense 90% of the time. That's what hair hack videos are to me. Just why are you doing this? Why is this happening? But also kind of like, why am I intrigued? What's going on here? And if you've never seen a hair hack video, you're about to be enlightened today. They do some really wild things and you're just like, why? But then some part of you just wants to do it to yourself for some reason. You're like, should I try that hack? on my own hair, and then you don't do it. Let's watch Five Minute Crafts show us how hair hacks are done. Plenty of things to watch with you and plenty of hacks to hack. We're gonna debunk them, give you my two cents on each of these hacks, and I'm sure it's gonna get quite wild. Let's do it. <laughs> blends into the wall and that's a problem. Just kidding, that's how I like it. First video is called 39 Must Know Hair Hacks by 5 Minute Crafts. Let's do the damn thing. By the way, it's just music this entire time playing so I'm not playing any of their sound. Uh, so yeah. Okay, so we have gems on up. Oh. <laughs> what? You cannot start this like this. There is no way. I literally just pressed play on this and we are getting gems on what looks to be packing tape and now we're ironing the packing tape onto our hair because why not? Oh, well that's not a hack. That's just literally hair gems. I actually thought she was just ironing packing tape onto her head. I don't know, okay? Looking good, sis. Okay, so we're bathing, we are washing our bodies, and we are going for it. Oh no, we're saying. Oh, I forgot my headband and my glue gun, and I'm gluing things to my headband. The inside of it, I'm gluing a shield, a plastic shield to my headband? Oh, no. <laughs> no, you can't go that fast past that. Are you kidding me? You're not gonna get away with that. No, no. <laughs> if any of you out there do this, please send me a picture. Please, I need to laugh. Kind of cool. I want to hate this. However, I don't. Listen, girl, if that's what you got to do, I mean, you could also use a shower cap that's like $1 or you could go spend about $30 in order to make this. Whatever you want to do is your life, man. Oh, sorry. I just realized she's trying to protect her makeup, not her hair. I don't know. We're moving on. Okay. We're trying to draw on her hair with marker. Oh, I'm familiar with this. I'm familiar with this. If you guys haven't seen my uh, following a Sharpie hair coloring tutorial yet, please go watch because I do something so wrong and I didn't know until you guys started commenting. You see how she just dipped one end of the marker into the water and that end she ended up blowing on? See, I thought it was the opposite. I thought you're supposed to blow on the end that you didn't dip in water. So I was like getting Sharpie in my mouth during that entire video and it definitely wasn't safe. So now I know in case you ever wondered. And also that's a lot of ink. Mine did not happen like that. Okay, so now we're doing hair color. She's just coloring her hair with, oh, those are actually pretty colored. Okay, and this wig is the actual most synthetic thing I've ever seen in my life. So I don't know how you're gonna color its synthetic wig, but um, we'll see. Maybe the marker will end up staying. Girl, don't play me like that. You just put clip-in hair extensions in your hair. Uh-uh, you are not getting past me, miss. Oh, you, oh, okay. Five minute craft, yeah, <laughs> I see you. You think you're gonna throw me off like that? You think you're gonna throw me off my game like that? No, you just put hair extensions in that fake synthetic of a head wig. I'm mad. 
Okay, moving on. Okay, we have eyeshadow and we're taking it to our hair. Uh, well, I mean, that's not really a hack. I mean, it is a hack if you didn't already know that you could do that. She looks kind of cool. <laughs> is it the best look? No. Was that kind of like unrealistic? Yeah, because like what eyeshadow were you using? How did that happen so easily? And the colors came out so vibrant. What's going on here? You know what I mean? Okay, here we go with some bangs, it looks like. Um, <laughs> we have plenty of uh, bang experience with my last week's video. Uh, hair just reacts to uh, horribly cut bangs or whatever I called it. <laughs> okay, so we are taking these horrible bangs. In what world? So she takes a barrette or a like a large pin and somehow her bangs get straightened. Never is that possible. Never. That is never gonna happen. In what world is that mathematically correct? Let me do the equation right now. No, it'll never happen. No, wrong. Okay, we have aloe vera, which I mean is, is great for hair. If you can find aloe vera near you, please go ahead with this hack. I don't even know what the hack is yet, but I mean, I do really like aloe vera, but wait. And then you just, so, oh, I've seen this one before. Okay, so they just happen to have like a magic bullet laying around. I mean, a lot of people do, and that could happen. And then they happen to have like some kind of seed and some kind of charcoal and aloe vera plant and time to make this thing, whatever they're making. Okay, I have no idea what's going on at this point. Oh, she's coloring her hair black. Oh, TTD. Again, a synthetic wig. <laughs> also though, why don't you just buy a crazy little thing called hair color instead of literally spending more money to make it yourself? If somebody has the answer to that question, leave it down below. Let a boy know. Let a bro, bro know. Okay, here's the other thing with five minute hacks and hack videos in general. I feel like they're just trolling us. Like they're fully just trolling the entire internet. I wanna be on set for one of these videos at some point. Five minute crafts, if you're like watching this, please hit me up. I just wanna know like what goes on on set. It must be the funniest, most interesting place to work at. You just hire a bunch of actors to do these like weird faces and pretend this shit is going wrong when they really don't care. They make the most dramatic faces to everything that's happening. I mean, like these wigs look crazy. Look at this girl. That's supposed to be dandruff. <laughs> she is so mad. Soap without BH, B, what? distilled water, soap without something and some charcoal. I don't know what that was. Okay. And we're funneling it into, and now it's in a, okay. Is that purple shampoo? Use only for dark hair. Okay, wait a second. What did they put in that? What? Wait, what? I just rewatched this and they still don't tell you what the black stuff is. What kind of hack is this? Okay, so she has dandruff. Let's break this scenario down. She has dandruff and then we move on to a scene where they have a bowl and they put random black powder in the bowl and don't tell you what the thing is. And then they tell you to put soap without BHBA. I'm sorry, I don't know what that is. So if you could help me with that one, that'd be great. And then they put something else and then they put it into a bottle and then she puts it on her hair and then something happens. We are not sure what happens. I still don't know what this black stuff is. I, uh, uh, mm. They put this liquid inside this bottle and then all of a sudden watch watch this one They pump it out and the shit turns into soap in what galaxy? It, you, I'm over that one. I'm, I'm pissed. All right, let's let's watch a nice little little styling one This will calm me down a little bit Oh, oh be really cute on like a two-year-old. Maybe like a 12-year-old also would look good in that, but let's not put on a full-grown adult. No full-growns. Okay, pull the hair back, put an elastic in, put a pencil in, wrap the hair around the pencil. Where are we going now? What is this? Oh, I don't have any reaction to that. Who in the world is sitting around thinking of these things? What kind of sorcery is this? Oh my God. 
Lady Gaga beware. Oh my God, who? Yes, I love it. Let's crochet some hair. Okay, two fingers, man. Because one ain't enough. So we're wrapping the hair around in a lot of circles. And the, mm. Okay, how did that just happen? That was cool. No, <laughs> no, no. There is no galaxy on earth that is going to work out. I'm just saying that is not possible. Let's watch that again. Let's get a recap here. So she puts these really tight twists in her hair and waits for a while and then takes them out. And all of a sudden she has curling iron waves in her hair all of a sudden and somehow twisting her hair in a tight corkscrew made that happen for her. No! Okay, elastic through the hair and through the hair. Okay, oh, that was the style. No, cool, yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it. I get it, that's cool. I just saw the most wild thumbnail. So we're gonna watch this video. It's 14 hair hacks and hairstyles. Every girl should know by the one, the only, Troom Troom. Boom, boom. Okay, what's up girl, what's going on? Is that gonna come back later in the video or is that the entire thing we just saw? Was that the hack? Um, let me skim through this and find out that. I just skimmed through the entire video and I can confirm that was the full hack. That was all. Is beauty pain? No, especially if you know our life hacks. What? What? <laughs> this isn't 1980 anymore. We don't need to be Ironing our hair with an actual iron. You're gonna sizzle your hair off. Oh, mm -mm. don't do that to your hair. It's not a good idea. Your hair will burn. Those things get so hot. This girl's face too. She's like, why did I just do this? Like, why did I just do that to this girl? Like, she's my friend. Like, I don't want her hair to fall off. And the girl's like, you can do it. I'm okay down here. And she's like, no, seriously, I don't want to do this to you. And she's like, no, really, just do it. And they did it. So that's how that went. If you don't have a lot of time, but a lot of friends braid each other's I hair. I have neither. Rosie's hairstyle is very simple, but it looks great. Separate a strand of hair and twist it so you get a loop. Pull another strand of hair through it. Twist it into a loop the same way. And keep braiding towards the other side and fasten it with a bobby pin. It's elegant and very easy. In what world is that elegant or easy? Yuck! Don't ever wear your hair like that. I wanna know where she's wearing that hairstyle to. I highly doubt she's wearing it anywhere. How much does getting my hair dyed cost at a salon? <laughs> what? I can buy a pony with that much money. I'll do it myself. A what? Did she just say a pony? What salon are you going to? I wanna work there. A pony? Says I... I just need a lot of paper. Cut rolls of colored crepe paper what? into strips. Cover every color with hot water in separate containers. <laughs> no, she can do this to her hair. Here you want to dye into a ponytail and dip the ends of the ponytail into the lightest color from the palette. With paper? Keep your hair in it for a few minutes. Paper? Take it out and blot it with a paper towel. Dye the bottom strands the same way using darker shades. Soak them in the colored liquid and pat it dry with a paper oh, towel. How, how do we just go hair. from paper to hair color? Dyeing your hair can be colorful and cheap. This looks just as good as if I'd gone to a salon. I can't! The delivery of that line was just too much. It really pushed me over the edge. This looks just as great as if I went to a salon. You can tell the girl doing the voiceover is like, do I actually say that line? This hair color looks as good as the salon. She's like, is, is that my line? Should I say it? She, they're like, yeah, just, you should deliver it. Just really give it to us. Really give us that delivery. And she gave it to us. So believable, Drum Drum. That was a lot. That was a stretch. Let's watch a few more. She is boiling water. She's putting flaxseed and boiling that. And now the flaxseed's gone. And now she has a stocking and a cup. 
and jelly. That was so cool looking. And now she's squeezing the flaxseed jelly out and she has flaxseed paste now. I wanna touch that. <laughs> okay, flaxseed, I mean, sure. You could totally do that. You could also just buy a product with flaxseed in it. Call me a genius, I don't know. Okay, honestly, that was intriguing. Flax seeds are rich source of omega-3 fatty acids. These fatty acids are essential for healthy hair growth, nourishing follicles and hair shaft, making them stronger and less prone to damage. Well, okay, flaxseed. I didn't know you could do all of that. Maybe have to add some of that into some of my hair products. Ooh, that was like the most practical uh, one I've seen in this entire time. So that was kind of good. Okay, so we have a fork. We're wrapping the hair around the fork. And I don't like the sight of using kitchen utensils in hair. And that's just me though. Uh, and we are ironing and we are letting it go. And we are getting, yeah, the absolute most atrocious spiral curls I have ever seen. Good job. Okay, now we have a chopstick. This will be better. This is a thing. This is definitely a thing. Oh, what's gonna happen? Oh. oh, tight curl. This is offensive. Is she gonna iron her hand now? I've done this one. It doesn't really work that well. Like, why not just curl it with a curling iron? Oh, that's. In what f***ing world is that a beach wave? Where? What world? When? What time? How? Oh, they're giving us one more. The pin. I think I tried some of these. This one looks the most promising. Oh, I did do this one. I totally did this one. Theirs came out kind of good, I feel like. Okay, see, that one is cool. It's not a retro curl, however. It is cool. If you did somebody's whole head like that, dude, it would be sick. Dude, it would be like, Ooh. Okay, I think that was enough hair hacks for today. I'm all hair hacked out. What can I take away from this video, you ask? I know that's exactly what you were thinking. Well, I actually learned that flaxseed um, is great for the hair. I learned that hair hacks are so far from real life. This leaves me even with more questions. Slightly more intrigued. Why do these videos intrigue me? They are the most bizarre, videos I've ever seen in so many ways, from the voice of the person, from the people doing the hacks, to the person coming up with the script for these videos, and the person doing the set for them, and the makeup and the hair. You're all weird. I don't know what their demographic is, but I don't think it's me, or it is me. <gasps> the prophecy is true. All right, you guys, I'm gonna get off camera and go think about these hacks more. Um, if you'd like to follow me on Instagram and Twitter, please do. It's GrabMondoNYC. And uh, I also have a hair care line called X Mondo Hair, which you know what? Just go on the website, read the reviews, check out the videos, check out the descriptions of each product. You'll see why so many people love my hair products. And that stuff just speaks for itself. So if you're wondering, are your products good? Uh, let me tell you something. Yes, all the reviews speak for themselves. So thank you guys for those reviews, by the way, if you've left one, um, I really appreciate it. And appreciate if you've bought my products and appreciate if you've supported me in any which way at all, even just by watching this video or leaving a like down below. Thank you for being here and thank you for doing that and thank you for being you. And if you wanna stay up to date on new product launches, which are happening very often in 2020, uh, follow Xmondo Hair on Instagram at Xmondo Hair. And that is all for today. Thank you so much for watching today. Don't forget to live your extra life. And I'll see you next time. Bye.